What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Joel Shell. But about to tell you how to call a couple facts. I'm a call Today we're gonna do bench press, and I'm gonna use the slingshot for a little bit. My plan right now is to warm up pretty well. Don't waste too much energy on like uh, working sets. I'm going to overload and in an attempt to overload my nervous system, kind of shock it back to where it was. Uh, plan on putting around maybe 430 to 440 on the bar and knock that out for two to three reps. And then I'm going to take off the slingshot and start on my working sets. I, I'll probably be a little fatigued after after hitting um, 430, 440, whichever one I end up going to. But with a good amount of rest in between the sets, I don't think it'll be that big of a deal. Now, my thinking by doing this is that I'm gonna have the heavier weight in my hand. I'm gonna move it, working on the eccentric portion of the lift. All right, so this is where I do that thing I was talking about earlier, where you overload, work on your negative, the eccentric portion of the lift, and then you lighten it up, and go back to your working set. So what I have like 435, hit that for a double, before that hit 410 for a double, and then without the same shot, I think it's like 3, 385 for a double. So now we're gonna go, we're gonna go below 385. We're gonna go back down uh, 365. Probably hit that maybe like three or four times depending on, on how I feel. And then see if we need to do that for sets or just keep on going down and then add more volume and more reps into the workout. probably knock out like one more set of these and then I'll move on to either I don't know one more set of these either drop the weight or move on the military press standing military ended up doing uh 320 close grip I didn't even have an arch in my back kept my feet flat just try to work on that that connection throughout the entire body from my feet to my knees to my hips all the way up to my chest and then up to my elbows my arms my wrists whatever you want to call it just working on that 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 bodily connection you have to have it so uh, I think I got that for seven or eight I lost count around six and on that last rep I was like yo you gotta fight you have to fight right now moved on to dumbbell military presses standing yo, that was fun I like that man I like I really I haven't been doing accessory work a lot mostly from time for time constraints but I got to the gym about 30 minutes earlier today so I got done with all my working sets and I was able to move on to accessory work without being rushed for time really. That was great man to, to you know work on those those hypertrophy uh, those hypertrophy movements. If you were with me a few months ago man you know I got a joke about hypertrophy or whatever so this is our inside joke. But yeah man I got, I got a pump I felt ooh, I still got some chalk on my hand. I got a pump it felt great that's what I like man you hit that like that primal state you know what I'm saying I, I almost got there I was feeling it coming but it's time to go ooh and I'm not getting blamed for leaving no more weights in the gym it's not me and I called you out today I didn't catch you like I wanted to but I let them know it wasn't me and I'm not playing a game today you set me up on a fine hey that's them right there see look not me somebody go get there for you and wait for them because I'm not getting blamed for that <laughs> I told y'all about that email account I set up, joelshell198 at gmail.com. If you don't want to leave a public comment, but you got a question, just send me an email to that account. joelshell198 gmail.com. I'm going to get back at you. Have a good day.